Oh, looks a lordy, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for another video game board game. <gasps> and today we'll be playing this game called Tetris. 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 I don't know. I mean, I think we get we're really scraping the bottom of the barrel with these really obscure board games. Yeah, I mean, who's yeah. heard of Tetris? No idea. I don't even know what country it's come from, personally. No. I mean, it doesn't give anything away in a box at all. No. Is it somewhere? It could be Mars, for all I can mm. tell. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Something it's a sandcar, something maybe it's some sort of doom scene or something. Yeah, like that. Possibly. I've never heard of the game. I've certainly not heard of the theme that goes do, 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 whilst you desperately try and get the little space shuttle to take off on your Game Boy. <laughs> So apparently Tetris is now the ultimate test of advanced territorial strategy for all the family. <laughs> it's not for my dad, he hates board games. <laughs> my dad doesn't understand board games, and I mean he snakes and ladders, gets over his head and over. You go you go, you go down the snakes? Yes, Dad. <laughs> God's sake, that's why you win every single game, because you think you go up them. Now some purists would regard that as cheating. Yes. Uh, now this is quite an interesting thing. This is actually a very, very early licensed product on Tetris. And more interesting is Tomy is actually licensed a game from Nintendo and not Illorg, which was the Russian division mm. set up just to license Tetris products. How bizarre. So yes, yeah, so this is it's a legal minefield. It, it, it is, it's technically illegal, uh, this game, <laughs> because uh, they did, well, actually it was on the market for long. But yeah, it is technically illegal because they licensed from Nintendo. Nintendo didn't have any rights to sell board games. On this, uh, it should have been Elorg. They wow. had the rights. So yes, it's a bit naughty of Nintendo. This is. Oh dear, I'm sure many people were killed. Yes, but it is a Tomy double player game developed from Nintendo's Tetris Game Pack. Pack, yes. Oh my goodness, I haven't seen that written for a few years. So Why do they say double player? Don't they mean two player? Can it only be played by Siamese twins or something? Oh, schizophrenics. Yes. <laughs> That's not what schizophrenia is, Larry. Don't oh. get me started. Oh. Um, right. What's on the side of the box? I want to see weird children in funny jumpers playing it. No, I miss that from 70s games. It's just, no, this is, this is early 90s. This is mm. 90, 90, 91. Well, yeah, I, I don't let have licensed the board game before I invented it. No. It would have been <laughs> it come out in 85. I got that long ago. Terrifying. So, yeah, poor old Alexei Paginov didn't get a penny of this until uh, 2000. So Good God. Not only is this a legal product, he also didn't get a penny out of it. So, poor old son. Yeah. But there they go, that's enough hardships. What's on the back of the box, by the way? Anything interesting? Oh, there's something on the back. You know, I thought it was mine. It's full colour printing, so yes. Ooh, look at that. So yes, you get all your favourite characters from the Tetris <laughs> universe. <gasps> look, it's the wonky blue one. It's, He's my favourite. That's the Z shape. Now, He's a dream It's R, S, Z, L, O, T, and long one. <laughs> that's everybody's favourite character, the long one. Yes, you're always waiting for the bastard yes. to come in. Actually, I got I had a bug on my Game Boy one, and I had about five or six in a row. Once. Wow! Oh yes, it's like heaven. Well, but that's then again, Tetris the Blast does that. Numbers. There's an actual app you can get for Tetris Blast. You have to pay 69p to get a mode where you get nothing but long four ones, which. So therefore, you're paying 69p for to have the entire point of the game removed. Yes, basically. <sighs> Modern gaming, eh, folks? I like this. Uh, Dog there, if you make that out. Ooh, sad Onion's got a pet. Yes. Or is it Sad Onion's been eaten? Yes, what is by it? By the sated dog. He oh my amazing. god, it's, it's a very square dog. It's a... That is a strange thing. Anyway, it's got full strategic play instructions inside. Oh, I want to talk about the trapezoid dog. The tra tra trapezoid dog? <laughs> what? He has a bit of a. He looks like sort of something from an old 70s educational programme. Charlie says, <laughs> keep, <laughs> keep Tetris pieces away from dogs. <laughs> Don't feed them to them. It's also got Nintendo Silla quality on the back as well, which is quite nice. And if you notice that. Uh, yeah, despite the fact they apparently didn't have the rights to yeah, use it. But other very than that, naughty Nintendo. Naughty, naughty. There we are. That's in. So, we basically place Tetris pieces according to the random O selector. <laughs> Exciting. The randomizer. And yeah, every time you make a certain amount of lines, you push the opponents. Well, it says there, doesn't it? Single there. Oh, yeah, there's the scoreboard. Single one. So one line moves that one in the direction of the opponent. Double, three, triple, five, and a Tetris will give you seven. And if you get five at once, then you're a fucking cheat. I think out of all the board games, it's probably the video games adaptations. This is probably the hardest to actually get right because Tetris only really works in a sort of digital world where, of course, 
Tetris pieces can't disappear. This is entirely true. In the physical true. world. Unless you have sort of acid at hand and you can <laughs> play one game. You don't even need to border any pieces. <laughs> no. And technically, you could actually sort of play this on paper, couldn't you? I suppose you could. Really, if you sort of put sort of put pieces in a yeah on a dice and then coloured in, yeah. So uh, if you're ever locked in prison and all you've got is a notebook, you can actually construct your own Tetris board game. Yeah. You heard it here first. Yes, it might be a way to stop yourself getting shanked. Yes. <laughs> or stabbed with a yes. long piece. Yeah. <laughs> a long four. Yeah. Did, did you have names for these pieces when you were... No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Well, that was Steve, Brian, Billy, Trevor. Yeah. Trevor. Good old Trevor. How you doing, mate? Nice to see you. Yeah, T for Trevor. Ah, we'd better play this bloody yes. game, then. I was a lonely child. <laughs> Give names to your Tetris pieces and your fingers. Yeah. <laughs> right, then. Let's rock. Who wants to go first? Um, you go first, because okay. you won the last time, probably. Did I, I asked I won Turbo, didn't I? So I should place it here. I should place it there. We've done exactly the same thing, just opposite. I thought, so we do both. Oh, there's a point. No, we don't. You oh. take turns, do we? Oh, we've got to find the instructions for Tetris. Oh my god, I assumed we did it all um, simultaneously. Well, that would be a bit pointless, really, wouldn't it? It'd be synchronised Tetris play. Oh yeah, we'd be doing exactly the same thing yeah. each, wouldn't we? Yeah. So we could end up in a draw again. In fact, there would be pretty much yeah. no other so option, unless somebody was really Remove your L, important. please. Oh. And you shall press the randomizer. And <laughs> oh, there you go then. Absolutely worthless. Oh my goodness, we talked that one up. Off you go, Squire. Ooh, long four. I should put this at the end. That's the most useful place to put the long four. Well, I noticed a pattern emerging already. Oh, you've got a, you've got a cube there coming on there. Bit of a chocolate bar. Yes. Ooh, another long four. So I shall place that there. I've technically got the same thing as you. Oh yeah. So what is your experience of Tetris? Where's the first place that you played this game? That would have been the original Game Boy version. Oh. So how did you get? How did you procure your Game Boy? I bought a Game Boy. I went to the shops. Oh, okay. And bought it. Oh, is that, that it? No, no, a hilarious anecdote. No, that's it. I think my my mate had a Game Boy for a while, um, and I got a part-time job. Mm -hmm. Enough to buy a game, but I went and bought. Oh, bloody hell! So you're quite old when you got your game, were you? Oh, yeah. you a paper round thing. Oh no, no, it was after that. Um, yeah, I got oh, Tetris I and a Spider-Man game with it. Spider-Man mm -hmm. versus the Sinister Six or something. Oh, no, so. versus the Spider Slayers. That was it. Oh, quite yeah. a good game. Oh, okay. Was it LJN? Wouldn't it be me? Probably. Oh, okay. I shall tell you my anecdote for getting Tetris. I got it as a Christmas present. Ooh. But I, um, it was one of those, those years when you used to sneak about getting Christmas presents. So I peeked in a corner of one of the presents Ooh. to look. And I found out I was getting a Game Boy. all excited. And then my parents hid it from me for most Christmas Day. They hid it behind the curtain. I didn't know. So I thought, oh, bloody hell, you know, got all miserable. They, done, they knew I found out. They knew I was, <laughs> had ripped a corner open and did it to me. They played but, with your mind, like. Yes. But I got it. I got Tetris with it because it's free. And I also got Mario Land. Oh. It's, uh, oh, yes, I did get Mario Land 2. Oh, okay. Well, it, is a, it is a legal requirement to get a Game Boy with Mario. Yes. Ooh. I really liked Mario Land 2. That was, it was far better. Six golden coins. Um, I remember completing it, but I got to like the end boss and then couldn't work out how to get past it and left it for like six months and went back to it and went, oh, it was obvious. <laughs> and just did it immediately. Some genie at the end of her recall. It was Wario. Was it? Wario. There was definitely a genie involved. Are you sure that was Wario f Wario Land? Oh, it was Wario Land the genie. So that was Mario Land 3. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Yeah, and this is why I'm screwed up a little bit because oh. I've got the S and uh, I'll have to put it there. Oh, now mm. it's getting dodgy. The difference is you won't have to use skill to manoeuvre it in, mm. you can just place the piece. There's quite a bit of controversy in the modern Ooh, Tetris yeah. games now as well, I don't know if you know about it. The, uh, oh. the floating block. The I don't floating know. block? Yes, I don't know if you know about this. Basically, what when is you, this madness? Basically, when a piece, uh, you could destroy a piece and it falls down. Mm. Uh, so, like, like you, yeah. If you, if you, if you got a line like that, you it, that bit will go disappear oh, and fall down. So people don't like that because they say it's not in. Yeah, that shit. sets up huge chains and stuff, doesn't it? Oh, I've asked this up now. <laughs> God, I'm getting a yeses on. 
Well, this is going well. I'm pleased with this. Oh dear. I know what you're going for. Ooh, at least I'm getting some. Yeah, that's more like it, isn't it? Come. Ooh, I've got a blue one. It's a bit funky, isn't it? It's sliding about. Oh, yeah. They could do with a sort of stronger mechanism for holding the pieces down. Mm. Like glue. Well, they should make it more like Lego, really. I mean, there's no yeah. needance to pull it down. That's a good point, actually. We're nearly out of these red L's already. Mm, yeah. Oh, we've got an R. So I put it there, and I've got a three now. You have. So I have a three. So how many do I have for forward? You, you get to move forward five. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. And it Ooh. bears absolutely no relevance to you whatsoever, does it? And you get to put that into mark, the Ooh. furthest line down. And I don't know why, because there seems to be no rule that actually takes it in. Because it no. doesn't seem as if a draw is possible, so it's not like a tiebreaker. No, I think we'd either run out of pieces by then, or... I think we would be stuck way before we could run out of pieces. This is another problem about... Is it you taking two turns at once? Is that the problem, is it? Larry? Is, oh, it, is that sorry. the problem? Sorry. Is it, is it? No, I was so, <laughs> I was so in, enthralled by your anecdote. <laughs> but, uh... That's an right, anecdote, turn it on me. Uh, ooh, ooh, I like this one. There we are. That'll do nicely. Ooh, it's a ooh. long four. I'm going to have to put it down here so I can... But this is a problem about having a physical version of Tetris, is you've only got a finite amount of shapes. Yes. It's like, oh. Well, I need to do something soon to move that bloody thing back. Mm. Well, you need a long four, don't you? That's, that's the only thing about per preparing a... <laughs> bloody S things. Hmm. Then I'll have to put it there. There you go. Oh, yeah, that works. Uh, there is a rule that you do have to physically go by the rules of Tetris that they can't, you can't, like, yeah, you can't, you know, you, they have to go in the, the feeling yeah. of the game that they drop in. You can't sneak them in. Yeah, you can't fit them like in, yeah. yeah. So they have to physically. It has to be a possible move in the game of Tetris. Yes. So I've got an L, so I can put that there. Hey. Oh, bloody hell. So technically, yeah. So that means I can't put a long four one in there because it wouldn't fit. Yeah, I'm like two away from the top now. This is not good. You are going to lose. I mean, yeah, you need to, I get, need to get the long four. The Tetris God is not smiling on me. <laughs> so, uh, did you ever play the Link Up uh, version of Tetris on the original Game Boy? No. Oh, it was tremendous. Me and my friend used to do one of those Link Up cables he had. It was so stressful because the music keeps getting faster and faster yeah. the closer you are to so doing any of dropping pieces on the opponent. It was a brilliant game. Oh my goodness, thank you. I'd like to hold off for the four, but I think I really need to get that thing. No, yeah, you get out of the way because you're going to die. So, uh, I did play the online one for the 3DS where you could play eight players at the same time. What, eight players? Two, three, four, five. Oh, of course, it's about seven. Well, you've done four. No, oh, you didn't. You've done three. No, you've done three. Oh. <sighs> Oh, yeah. No, I think we're back to evil now. It's evil, even. <laughs> we're back to evil. Yes. We well, always have That's the furthest you ever got, so. Ooh. <laughs> Hark at you. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to put that there. See, I couldn't put that in there. That's pretty much lost now. I, that hole there is definitely lost. Yep. You've destroyed everything. Oh, bloody hell. Put an L there. I'm going to stick an R. I'm going to go like that. Okay, well, you're a, bit, you're a bit more uniform than I am. I'm pretty... Sc I'm I could leave the potential for weird pieces coming mm. later. I'm going to have to put that... There. Ah. Nice, <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm pretty screwed up. I'm going along for... What do you think about uh, Tetris being, youth um, being a metaphor for communism? As well, have you? Have you? Have oh you, my you, god! Have you no, but I could before? hazard a guess, I suppose. Oh, I got a T. It's the first T for me. Yeah. T Basically, T. it's um, Tetris means that your successes in life are instantly wiped away, and only your mistakes are there for permanent. Oh, so that's how. But they're... if you keep going, you can wipe away the mistakes as well. Nothing is truly permanent in the game of Tetris. That analogy has failed. Oh. Mm. 
I and also the other thing was that Tetris is the most perfect game as well ever made. Most perfect game. Ever well, made. you don't need to be culturally aware of Ooh, Tetris. culture fair, as we call it in psychology. Yes. Yeah. That you, everybody knows what a block. This is it based on mathematics, and mathematics is a universal. It's true. Language it's a sort of game of common sense. I mean, almost. like you say that Pac-Man. Oh, I'm, I'm really screwed up now. <laughs> I've got. Uh, your tears taste sweet. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to have to go there, and I've got an L-shape there. That's amazing. <laughs> no, I've, <laughs> You've made an inverse piece, yes. yeah? an anti-matter piece. Yeah. Yeah. Where was I? Oh yes, it's the it's perfect game, because like, you like talking about Pac-Man, that you would have to know what ghosts are. Oh yes, to know to avoid them. Yes, because yeah. uh, if, if you didn't have ghosts in your culture, it's you not wouldn't know what they were. Yeah. That's an interesting thought. I mean, my dad could probably play this, and he's in his 70s. Mm -hmm. My friend Chris, who has never played a video game except Tetris, really loves Tetris. He actually bought a second-hand Game Boy recently just to play it. Oh, with completely blurry screen. Yes. And it was really expensive. Got a oh, in see, well, I'm screwed up. i got one there, so I go forward one. You do? But I've really messed up. I'm not really that bad at Tetris. It's... I don't believe you, Larry. I think you're the worst Tetris man who has ever tetris Tetris is a verb now. <laughs> The proper word for these are tetrominoes as well. well that's nice. Like a domino, but tet 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 mm. And there is actually a, a proper game that you can get that you sort of you have to fit them all in a box. That's what they're based on. Basically, you stole a board game. Oh, oh I don't like this because that's oh that's dangerously close. You want to go down two and I lose. Yeah, you, you don't want to do that. Oh, I may have made. You error. might have to sacrifice a, the hole in there to put it in. Oh, but nobody wants to sacrifice the hole in there. Mm. So now you know I'm, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm going to fly close to the wind. Mm, it's dodgy. Anyhow, my turn. Oh, I've got... So it's getting quite intense now. Yes. Stressful. Well, at least I've got a decent space now. See, I'm playing the long game. Whereas, uh, it's going to come back and bite me in the ass if I'm not careful. Oh dear, as may have already happened. Oh dear. Are you looking forward to the Poyo Poyo board game? <laughs> <laughs> the Clax board game. <laughs> you could physically make Clax, couldn't you? Well, not the Clax board game. No, cla you used to do, they used to do golf clap when you win around, oh, yeah. didn't they? Yeah. They didn't mind, I had it on Spectrum. Oh, okay. Um, this is the 90s. This is Clax. <laughs> I hated Clax. Everybody hated Clax. I'm going to have to do that because I can't risk going up anymore. Disappointing. Oh, bollocks. It's the only time you don't want a long four, really, isn't it? Yeah. Now, I could put it down there and automatically get a line forward and screw you up, but then they... Oh, bollocks, I'll do it anyhow. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I like your thinking there. So, I, I am making lots of mistakes in this, but I am being quite threatening. Yeah, I really need that long four. So yes, then... if you get a long four, I'm completely screwed. Yeah. As well. If I don't, things are getting quite tight. No, I'm not going to stoop for that for what she said. <laughs> <laughs> As the actress said to the bishop. Not, not. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, shit. Three, that will be five in your direction, I believe. One, two, three, four, five. Uh huh. That's looking good. I'm happy with that. It's going to be very hard for you to do anything yeah, there. Yeah, I am. I'm going to have to. And I'll almost certainly get another line in a couple of turns, minimum. Oh, I'm pretty messed up now. I mean, I've made so many mistakes. I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. Oh, the one I didn't <laughs> You needed a red one. Mm. Well, I don't think there's any danger of you getting three lines now, so... Three lines on the shirt. Oh, dear. All the that means are wrong. I can't... I'm going to have to put it there. I'm actually right on the edge now. <laughs> the, the only one that isn't going to do what I need. I could, I suppose. Oh, can I? Yeah, let's do that. No. Shame about the hole. There's a hole anyway. So. One more towards you. No. Oh, no. It is blocked. <laughs> it appears that somebody has won, and that person is not you. Mm. <sighs> and... No. 
We were very relaxed. Yes. <laughs> we were very foolish and sort of aggressive in that sort of mode, yeah. rather than if you weren't sort of forward thinking. No, you see, I, I was, my playing the long game worked out, and I got some crappy knives as well. So what you, you had far more long fours than I did. Mm. That must be. Sad. I had three, four, four, four long fours. I had. Oh no, I didn't have three. I didn't have that many more actually. I apologise. Main thing is we've got a picture of the Kremlin, so everyone's oh, happy. Good. Very colourful. Looks Kremlin. like Willy Wonka's chocolate factory, doesn't it? <laughs> Covered in ice cream. Nobody ever goes in. Yeah. <laughs> Just like com communist Russia. <laughs> Eventually Gorbachev comes out with a stick and then suddenly does a cartwheel. Oh, oh, I was going to say uh, Slugworth comes past and stabs you with a poison umbrella. <laughs> <isn't it>? Oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> Good old Slugworth. <laughs> Such an overlooked character. <laughs> uh, well, that was a good game, because I won. It was, yes. So to be fair, that works really well. That is quite a nice little game, isn't it? And it is close enough to Tetris to make sense. Mm -hmm. I think that's one of the best ones we've played. Yes, yes. It's... Should we keep playing? We'll put we'll send it to the middle and see if it keeps going. Should we do it? Or, all should, right. we, or should we end it? Yeah, all right. Okay. This will be like an endurance thing, endurance. where this doesn't move anymore. And yes. uh, yeah, just seeing who can... So we're just going, just because it's quite a short video, this one. Yeah, so oh, it's my turn last, so you're one next. Okay. L. L. T. T. Is for Tetra. No, 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 no. Endurance, we ain't got no life insurance. <laughs> do we do? God, you'll get a content ID match yeah. then. <laughs> I thought, wasn't there some sort of law that a cappella is copyright free or something? That's interesting. I think I heard something about it. Is that how Smooth McGrew gets away with it? Well, he still uses game music now, doesn't he, in the background? True. I thought he just hid behind his hair when they came for him. <laughs> uh, it's not here, man. It's just Cousin It. That's yeah. it. <laughs> I always feel sorry for his cat when he holds it up. <laughs> I'm sure it enjoys it. Who? Cousin It? Yeah. <laughs> No, um, oh, okay. you ever seen some, He always has a cat. Oh, okay. So, so I don't remember Cousin It ever in a cat. No, that was Uncle Fester. He ate it. He used to eat light bulbs. Yes, and turn them on, didn't he? Mm. With his electric tongue. Ugh. That sounds like a problem. Well, it's quite good if the power goes out and you have to go under the stairs and it together. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever have any other sort of electric powers, or was that the only time that was mentioned? I don't know. He's got an AC adapter up his arse or something <laughs> Doesn't fest his horrible secret. He can st start a car by attaching and his balls in there. <laughs> Every man's dream. Yeah. Have you, have you got any double A batteries? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, he's triple A. I need batteries. <laughs> Kept me in a Guinness. I think he said Kelly McGuinness there. Oh, okay. Is, is she entirely relevant to the situation? Just don't ask for the D's. Yeah. Oh god, D cells. <laughs> Come walk for a week. <laughs> well, the T. So we're coming. So oh. we're, we're, we're abusing the rules here by just going on for the. Yeah, just droning on. And... Yeah. Actually, it's a sort of game that you could play on your own. It's a bit of like a sort of solitaire, really. I have a solitaire version, an electric version with real pieces that you actually drop in and it plays music. Have you? Yeah. Oh. I forget what it's called. Tetris something. Tetris Electric? <laughs> I've got no idea. Pretty nifty though. Oh. <gasps> you have to put two in now. No, I don't. You have, you have got the dreaded nether Tetris. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what have I done? Yeah. The whole thing starts <laughs> shimmering and it's collapsing sad. in on itself. Oh. We've broken the laws of physics. Hang on, I'm still going for lines. Why am I going for lines? I don't know. Well, I'm tr there's no benefit of doing lines. No. Oh, I should have put that just in there to uh, it up. up. Unless you're a rock musician. Yeah. <laughs> there's definitely no benefit to it in the long term. I <laughs> <Like> kids. <laughs> oh. Oh. Right, an idiot. Oh my goodness, he's still alive. I need, I'll be all right as long as I've got a couple of T's. Oh, you're all right. You're, all right. you're fine, aren't you? Oh, yeah, lucky. Oh, look at that. Uh, you're pretty much yeah, no, I next can't, turn, no matter what. So basically, unless you... No, you, there's actually I no think way... I'm safe, yeah. There's actually no... Yeah. Okay, well, that's me pretty much screwed then, isn't it? Yep. <sighs> Game over, man. Game over. 
Yes. They're coming out of the goddamn walls. That was when Derek Jacobi was there, testing out for aliens. <laughs> Didn't get a part for someone. <laughs> Oh, well, that's the end of that then. That is very good. That is oh, genuinely yeah. good. I'm impressed. Oh, well, for an early 90s board game as well, so. Yeah, whoever designed that, well done. I hope they didn't get sued afterwards. Yes. So what would you what would you rate that out of 10? I would rate that as 8 out of 10. Oh, okay. Or 4 out of 5, so if you prefer. That's going to be going on Metacritic, is it now? Though? That's right. Yeah. <laughs> the only entry. Yes. <laughs> there you go. Anyhow, thanks very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we'd be sure to be uh, in What are you doing? Keep your fingers away. I'm letting my fingers do the walking. Ah. J.R. Hartley. Yeah. It is rather old. <laughs> Everything we play is rather old. <laughs> now, isn't it? Well, it is, uh, this is getting on for 20 years. It's, 20, uh, it's 1991 or 2 or something. So that is 21 years old. Yeah. Ooh. Bloody hell. Frightening. Oh, there you go. Well, thanks very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I've been Guru Larry. And I haven't. Bye.